Do you play a lot of Stardew Valley and are fed up with the animations taking so long? Well, there are mods, but not everyone wants to do modded Stardew. I'm going to share with you how to animation cancel in Stardew Valley without mods. Quick disclaimer, this is only for PC. It can't be done on consoles. Animation canceling is in the game code as what looks to be a debug command, allowing you to skip an animation at any time. If we skip an animation right after we use our axe, we can start another swing. And as you can see, chop like a maniac. So chopping faster, that's cool, but there's more. We can cancel any tool animation besides a fishing rod. It just, well, it does this. Mining, hoeing, watering, even swinging your weapon can use animation canceling. Keep in mind for hoeing and watering, if you've upgraded that tool, animation canceling doesn't work the same because of the charge up animation that happens before you can cancel. Okay, so you want to learn how to animation cancel. You simply press down R, right shift, and delete all at the same time. Have fun. Thanks for watching. What's that? Too hard? Okay, let's fix that. I'm going to use Razor Synapse, but any key rebinding program will do. All we need to do is rebind the keys to something easier, like the spacebar. To do this, we're going to create a macro on our keyboard. So we're going to click on the keyboard, we're going to make a new macro, and then we're going to record, right shift, delete, and R. And then I can just go in and delete the uh, extra bits here we don't need. Okay, so it presses right shift, delete, and R, slight delay, and then unpresses the buttons. I'm going to rename this, a cancel, and then we're going to go over to our keyboard, space bar, change the key assignment to macro, and then change this to a cancel. There we go. Now, you just need to press the space bar the moment your tool finishes its action. If you press too early, then your tool won't do any action. And if you press too late, then it'll be slow. You can see that it can be hard to get it timed just perfectly. And you'll miss actions until you get good at it. I'm going to take this a step further and make it even easier for you guys. Let's go back to Razor Synapse. And you'll see that I've added a left button or a tool action. And then I've added 0.18 seconds of delay. This is an exact amount. If you try to do 0.179, it may not work. So this is the exact amount that allows you to use any tool from any angle and it will animation cancel. You can actually make the delay 0.125. And it'll be even faster, but you can only mine, chop, and hoe from all angles besides from top down. So now we go, we can chop. That's even faster, but we cannot chop from above going down. Because above going down, it takes longer for your axe to hit the ground. And it's canceling just slightly too early. Keep in mind this works amazing for the club as well. Okay, okay, so that's basically everything, but there's actually one more thing you can do to make this even easier if you want to. Go back to Razor Synapse one more time, and to the very end of this, we are going to insert a delay. And this delay is gonna be 0.1 seconds. After we do this, we can go back to our keyboard and our macro that we've set up. And then we can, under playback options, set this to play while this key is pressed. And now we can just hold down the space bar and just let it do its work. I should also say that depending on your exact computer or your keybind program you, you're using, you may have to adjust this delay because, and you can't go top down, because it may be different for everyone in their certain situation. You can see that it's actually missing a tiny bit. So in this case, I would actually 
want to go back to my macros and adjust this to maybe 0.13 like that. And now we shouldn't have any misses. That's animation canceling. And if you're wondering how I do it in my 20 million in first year challenge, I don't use a macro because it could be considered cheating. I instead bind right shift and delete to my two side buttons on my mouse and then bind R to my space bar. I press all three of them at the correct timing for every cancel. Hope you guys enjoyed the explanation. You can check out animation canceling in action in my 20 million gold in hand in first year here. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss any more starter videos.